one, two, then I did this one, three, and now I'm on my fourth bottle of NAD booster. Uh, it's Niagen, and or this is a long word, the long name for it, Nico, Niame, I don't know, whatever. It's all the same, Robo, Robo, Robosai, Robosai, whatever. There is all different names for it. And then the short name is like just Niagen. So I started with these. I have like one left. And then I went to the, let's see what milligram is this one. Well, anyways, these were like 250 milligrams. And then now I'm at 330, well, isn't that funny? 333, ha, ha, ha. It's the, um, what do they call that? Freemasonry or something? Isn't that funny? They have it 333. That's like a, a masonry sign or number or whatever. I don't know that much about it. But anyway, okay. So what they did in the laboratory, they took a genetically modified mouse and they fed it this uh, niagen stuff. And after only a few weeks, the mouse actually reversed its aging back to like when it was very, very young. So they took like a very, very old mouse. It was like gray, fat, dying. And they gave it this niagen. And it went back to being like slim, shiny coat, no more gray hair, um, energetic, sexually active. It went to like being basically on its deathbed to being like very young again. And they did all these tests on it. Uh, the scientists did all this test on the mouse and they couldn't find anything different about that old mouse that went young compared to a young mouse. Like there was, they couldn't tell any difference. Like it was just like a young mouse again. So, am I a mouse? No. Is this going to take like a week or two to make you young again? No. Um, I've heard it, it. Okay. Some scientists say, nope, it ain't going to do anything. Other scientists say, yeah, it can help. So, okay, I'll tell you what I've noticed. I've only been on it for four months. That's not really long enough. I would say I want to give it a good six months, like another two more bottles. But what I have, what I do notice is the pros and the cons, which is pro. Yeah, it speeds up your metabolism and it gives you energy. Con, you'll eat more. I notice when I take this, I get really hungry. I didn't take any today because I don't, I'm kind of like doing a fat a watermelon fast right now. But um, yeah, it'll make you hungry. So is that good? Is that bad? I don't know. It will make you um, have lots of energy. That's for sure. I like did all this gardening work and which normally I, I don't have a lot of energy to do because I don't really like getting my hands all dirty and dark in the garden and everything. But, you know, it really will give you a lot of energy and ideas to create. I created this garden bed and all this other stuff in my front yard, whatever. But OK. Another thing it will do is it will, what it did for me anyway, it will um, kind of, I don't know how to explain this. It, it does something to your brain. I don't know how to explain it, but it kind of makes you think younger, I guess, like, or think back, like when you were like in your twenties and then you'll want to like relive those memories. And if you can't, well, I don't know. Will you get depressed from it? I don't know. I had times when I felt like I was going to cry because, you know, it's like I want to go back to like when I was 20 again. And I think about people in my life back then and I want to get in contact with these people. And yet, you know, I really don't have any way um, to do that. And they don't want, I don't think they want to. Cause like, you know how it is when you're 20 and you you're one way and then you grow older and you get another, you turn into like someone else or something, like all your cells are different and you think different and you, you have maybe have a different lifestyle and then you don't want 
to go back and remember people when you were like 20 because you're like, oh no, I was like that when I was when I was 20 and now I'm like this and I don't want that back in my life because you know what I mean? But it's like for me, yeah, I don't care. I just I just feel like it wasn't that long ago. It just doesn't seem that long ago. And yeah, it will make you um, have more sex energy, sex drive. It's helped a lot with my sex drive. So yeah, it's only been four months and I don't know. It's, it's not going to like make me 20 again. I, I would need stem cell therapy for that. And they don't have embryonic stem cell therapy in the U.S. It's only in Germany right now. But hopefully in a few more years, maybe they will. Because that really will um, help a lot, a lot more. There's a lot of things that you have. It's not just one thing you have. There's a lot of things you have to do. Diet, exercise, stem cell therapy can be part of that. And whatever else might come up in the next, come along in the next 10 or 20 years. I keep an eye on all this stuff, on all the anti-aging supplements and, and um, treatments and everything. So, yeah, it's just a matter of time. And eventually, I think eventually it'll, anti-aging treatments will be very common and, you know, people will be um, much more healthier. Um, you won't get sick anymore and you won't like turn old anymore. You'll just always look good. You're like prime you know, level, I guess you could say. But yeah, that's about it for now. Take care.